Good morning, Starshine. The Earth says hello. I hope you all are doing well. Um, so a while back I did a, um, a get to know me video as my first video on this channel, but, um, now looking back, I'm not really happy with how it went. I'm not really happy with the video in general. Um, Luckily, it's my only video on my channel because I've been a little lazy to film and post these uh, past few weeks. So, it's been about like a week and a half. But, uh, yeah, so now I'm ready to film again and get things started. Um, so I thought it would be fun to give that video another go. Um, basically, just do my makeup and talk a bit about myself, um, my interests and whatnot. I really do hope you guys can hear my stomach grumbling. Um, I haven't eaten today, so I really do hope you guys can hear that. Um, my lips are a bit dry. My mom got me this lip gloss. I'm just gonna apply it to avoid irritation. My lips are very irritated. I, um, I lick my lips and that is what drives them. Um, ironic, isn't it? Um, oh yeah, and I know my hair looks a little on the rough side, but, um, I recently got out of the shower and I didn't put any of my curling products in, so I have this hair clip that I'm going to be putting into my hair. I only decided that I was going to film um, after my hair was already dry, so... But my, my bangs don't look too bad. I look kind of decent. Um, so yeah, let's just jump into it. This intro is way, way, way too long. So, I'm gonna be using, all of my makeup products are here. Um, brushes to the side, beauty blender to the side, my, uh, foundation and blushes are there, and then my palettes are on the floor. Um, but yeah, I'm gonna be starting with this foundation that my sister gave me. It's Ever Beauties. It's in South Africa. It's a South Africa exclusive. It's matte liquid foundation, oil free. I'm just gonna put a bit on my hand. It's not even my shade, but it's a little bit too dark. But I do at least have a concealer that I can work with. So it's not that big of a deal. Okay, so sorry about background noise. Um, there are people in the house and they're busy and whatnot. So really, I have stuff to do and whatnot. So it doesn't really bother me. I really hope that it doesn't bother. But, um, a little bit about myself. I'm 19 years old. I'm currently studying, um, foundation phase education. Um, which is basically for grades, um, zero to three. So, preschool and everything. Yeah. So, grades one, two, three, and then preschool, kindergarten, so on and so forth. Um, I'm currently in my second year, so I did my first year last year, and it actually surprisingly went well for someone that really 
struggled to transition from going to school every day, um, actually being in class, taking notes and whatnot, having a entire schedule set up for you. It honestly was a big jump for me from being basically spoon-fed by teachers um, to doing it completely alone online. That's not an easy jump to do. I'm sorry if it looks like I'm not looking into the camera. It's because I'm using my phone to film and I don't have a mirror so I'm using my phone as a mirror. Okay. So last year I had the practical for grade zero, so preschool practical. They are six years old, five, six, and I did my practical at a school, um, at a primary school, because unlike America we don't have any um, middle schools here, um, and we work with a very different vacation system than the American and British schools do. Um, I'm not sure about Britain, but I know that um, there are certain schools, like in the Netherlands, they work with the American system as well. Um, but yeah, I did my practical last year at June, and it that went well, it could have gone better, but I mean like you do have colleagues that I don't know, influence you and so on and so forth, but this year I'm really looking forward to my practical because I'm doing a four year degree and um, first year you do preschool and then, well, you do grade zero. Um, over here it's called grade R. But, um, yeah, you, and then uh, second year you do grade one, third year you do grade two, and then your fourth year you do grade three. I really want to give class for grade three children, so I'm really looking forward to my last year of education. Um, but yeah, things are going well. So far, I recently registered and I actually um, got in, so I'm glad to know that they didn't like just dismiss my registration or anything because I saw the payment going through, so um, I'm just trying to cover up all of my bruises, all of my marks. I do actually struggle with acne a little. I have, um, well, as my sister says, I have fungal acne. So she bought me some skincare products yesterday and I have to use them very strictly. I have a sister, um, a brother. My sister is six years older than me. My brother is four years older than me. Um, I have a mom, a dad. Um, I have a brother-in-law. Uh, and then I have a cute little niece. And she's now 14 months old. And... She can say ball. And mom and dad and the other day she said aunt which is really cool um but i haven't heard her say it since um my sister actually caught the moment of her saying it um and i wasn't present which absolutely sucks so i'm gonna be moving on to my eyebrows and i have a very broken and messy palette um it's very old <laughs> it's quite unfortunate. Um, 
So yeah, it looks very messy. I only use this for my eyebrows. The brown in it looks very good. So, because I don't have an eyebrow palette. I used to have one, and then since my sister does more makeup than I do, um, I actually gave it to her. Or well, she took it and then I gave it to her. <laughs> so, yeah. Um, it's really hard without a mirror. But yeah, um, I'm 19 years old. I'm a Sagittarius. Um, the reason why I started ASMR was, um, I actually started a channel in, uh, 2021? Yes, 2021. And, um, I kind of just gave up on it. it. I don't, I don't know, I think I got too busy or, I don't know, demotivated. I don't know, I just stopped the channel, I deleted everything, um, but yeah, here I am, giving it another go. Surprisingly, I, um, I don't watch a lot of ASMR. I only, um, I watch videos where people make stuff, like, um, leather or build legos or painting um i like watching those videos and then i also like watching nile red and bomb garden restoration florian gatsby um Ami ceramics i love watching all of these people and um yeah sorry i thought there was an insect on my leg it was just my bottle um so this is my makeup palette my sister bought it for me, um, well she got it for me for Christmas, and it has all of these lovely, lovely colors in. Um, I'm practicing doing makeup, I don't really do makeup, I do makeup a lot now, but I haven't really in the past done a lot of makeup, so, um, yeah, but this is the makeup palette. Um, so, yeah, um, I think I'm gonna go for a natural type of look, but there isn't, like, any light browns or anything, so I think I would, I don't know, April, this color, this one, looks really nice, but I don't know how nice it's gonna look on my eyes. Um, yeah, so, that is very yellow. I need something red, but, um, yeah, uh, what do I like doing? Nothing. Um, no, I actually like, um, Playing solitaire. I'm a grandma. I know. I love playing solitaire, Sudoku, um, chess, uh, <laughs> not crossword puzzles or word puzzles to say. I'm not really good with word puzzles like that, but, um, I would say solitaire is my main one. I also listen to few podcasts, like Distractable, you need to go check it out, it's Mark Bob and Way. um, they're really funny, I also listen to, um, is it Monday Makeup Murders, um, but yeah, there's this girl, 
that does, um, she does her makeup, um, while telling a crime story, and it's really, really entertaining. Um, so you guys need to go check that out as well. Um, I don't really know what color to go for next, um, because I want to add some red to it. that's brownish red, but I know it's very pigmented, so that might be such a big mistake. Um, I think let's go for Shook, this one. I love the names of these. They're so entertaining. Um, but, um, yeah, so, 19 Sagittarius, um, I like watching movies, playing solitaire, and whatnot. Um, I like watching shows. I actually started, um, a show recently. Um, Ginny and Georgia. And I don't know how I feel about it. It's very teenage -y, but I don't know. I, I kind of like it. Like I said, I don't know how to feel about it, but we'll see. I think I'm only at episode four. Um, or five, I honestly don't know. But, um, that was not what I wanted to do, but. Um, I also, uh, I, okay, let me mention my favorite shows. Um, I am a trackie, so I love Star Trek. Um, I loved Haunting of Hill House and Haunting of Play Manor. Um, loved Outlander. Um, I do watch uh, Stranger Things. Um, Umbrella Academy, I still need to watch the new season. Um, loved Anne with a Knee and Spinning Out, but it's a shame they're cancelled. And, um, and also, I'm not okay with this. That was really good. Um, but yeah, some of my favorite movies are actually, surprisingly, space movies. I really loved the Star Trek movies. Um, Interstellar, Deep Space, ugh, Interstellar, um, The Martian, um, Avatar, anything space and alien related, um, Pandora's Box, is that the name of the movie where, oh gosh, I can't even remember what happens in that movie, um, but yeah. I think I'm going to go with Rochelle, which is probably one of my favorite shades, um, but yeah, um, so I also play instruments, um, I actually stopped playing last year, I don't know why I stopped, but I just stopped, um, I've been playing guitar since I, well, since 2018, um, and recently I've actually gotten back into it. So, yeah. Um, I also love playing games. Um, I love Sims, um, Minecraft, um, me and my sister actually started recently playing, um, Stardew Valley together, which is actually an awesome game, 
but I must say my favorite game of all time is probably um, Horizon Zero Dawn. I also really love um, Dead by Daylight, Death Stranding, The Last of Us, 1 and 2 was amazing. Um, Detroit Become Human, oh, that was good, that was good. Um, but yeah, that's basically the games and stuff that I really like. Um, but honestly, I'm horrible at games. I'm horrible at everything. I suck at bowling. I suck at beer pong. I suck at um, board games. Okay, not too much board games. But, no, oh, board games, I suck at that. Um, I can't really dance. I mean, like, I can dance if I want to. I can dance if I want to. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. way too pigmented. I'm just trying to get some of it off of my face. That looks a lot better. There we go. This video was very long. I also um really enjoy watching gameplays um, such as The Forest, The Raft. I even love watching Uno. Um, because I, I love watching Mark player, so anything that he plays, I love it. Um, Chi Chi Charles is also really good. I, I really like that as well. Um, but yeah, I, um, the 7th of February, I'm doing my learners. So it's basically the test you write before you go. To get your license, you have to pass it. Um, I don't know who has that in their country, but we have it in ours. I'm pretty sure every country has it, but um, it's probably a different name for everything. But um, yeah, uh, I'm doing that the 7th of February, so I've been studying for two days. Now I'm moving on to blush, and this is a shade that I actually don't use. The shade that I use is this one. It's very pink, it's very bright, but I really want to give this one a go. I have no idea how it's going to look on me, so we're just going to dab, dab, dab. Okay, I feel like I'm ready to play a sport, <laughs> but as Rudolph the Red Nose Reindeer. But, um, yeah, I'm actually really excited to start driving to get my license stuff, because I currently don't have a job, but I would really like to get a job. Um, I need to try looking for one, but it's unsuccessful. Um, but yeah, I'm really just, I'm excited to get a job and do something. I like working. Well, I hate working, but I love it. At the same time, I don't know how I feel about the shade of blush. Like, I feel like it looks, it looks good, but it also just doesn't. I look too yellow. Where's my regular blush? Oh, right in front of me. Let's go over it with this. It might be a little bit too much blush, but you know what? The 70s, the 60s, the 80s never scared anyone. 
actually see that fashion is reverting back to the 2000s. I don't know how I feel about it. <laughs> it would be fun dressing as the 2000s again. I remember watching Disney when I was little and seeing how they dress it looked really fun to just dress like that, put any clothes on and it would be called fashion. But yeah, I'm really excited to see how, like, the phone, like, I've seen items come back, like the purses and, um, some of the skirts and also some of the shirts, like the tube tops and, um, the entire thing of, um, wearing a tank top over a long shirt has come back, but, um, I honestly just wish we could actually fully dress like that again. That would be fun. I think it would be fun. And then now I'm gonna put on some highlighter. I actually don't have my highlighter brush with me right now. So we're just gonna go for a brush that I found. It's the brush that I use for blending. We recently watched the new Puss in Boots movie and it was actually, it was really good. I loved it. It was so good. It was so funny and the references, the easter eggs, I love them. So good. The type of music I listen to is, it's really strange actually. Um, because I listen to some K-pop, um, I listen to Stray Kids, um, some of BTS's songs, a few Blackpink. I'm not really a big fan of Blackpink, but I am a fan of BTS. I wouldn't call myself ARMY, but I am a fan of BTS. Um, some of their music like House of Cards or On. Those songs are amazing. And a few other of those songs like Stay Cold. Um, but I, I'm actually an independent music listener. So um, I listen to independent music, which is Ben Howard, Aurora, um, Low War, Low War, Low War, Low War, Low War. Roar. Roar. Low roar. Low roar. <laughs> Anyways, um... I, uh, I love their music. I listen to Billie Eilish as well. Um... Sid Matters. Uh, Keaton Henson. Um... And then you have my Stray Kids, <laughs> my K-pop, which is the complete opposite of what I usually listen to. Sorry if you're wondering what I did just there, I looked at something in the corner, thought I saw something. Um, I also listened to Rainbow Kid and Surprise. And then a bunch of underrated artists. <laughs> I love Bishop Riggs as well and Hosier. Um, Kaleo, um, Kaleo, Kaleo, Kaleo. I'll listen to them as well. Um, Spookwolf, which is a South African band. Their songs are really good as well. Um, personally, I don't really listen to them, but my sister does, and 
um, from what I've heard, their songs are really, really good. I also listen to some... Um, I listen to Ren, like R-E-N. His music is really good as well. Um, what else do I listen to? Ozier, Calio, um... Edward Sharp, The Magnetic Zeros. I love their music. Um, Olivia Rodrigo, her songs are really good. Um, Harry Styles, I am actually One Directioner. I have been since I was eight. So, <laughs> yeah, <laughs> 11 years being a One Directioner. That is a long time. But yeah, I love everyone in that group, Zane, Liam, Niall, um, but my two favorites are Harry and Louis. Um, I love Harry's music, but I must say Louis is my favorite member, even though you can't really pick a favorite member. I know it feels illegal, but, um, Louis is my favorite member. Um, I don't know, there's just something about him I just somehow connect to him. Um, but yeah, I'm gonna put on my lip gloss and then I'm finished. I hope you all enjoyed this video. I hope it's better than my previous one. For those who have seen that. Yeah. What's this? My hair still looks crazy. Just gonna do this again. Tie it. That's fine. Kind of looks good. But yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Um, please like. Please comment, please subscribe, turn on the notifications, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye-bye. Bye-bye now. <laughs>